A Williamson County deputy is fired after he was charged with resisting arrest and public intoxication. KVU News has learned the deputy is 41 year old Jack Danford Jr. Jenny Lee joins us now with the story. Jenny. Terry Danford was at a North Austin barbecue restaurant called Oakwood Barbecue Saturday night when trouble started. Now Oakwood isn't open on Mondays and according to court documents, Austin police responded to a disturbance call there Saturday night just before 745. Now when officers arrived in the back patio, they immediately smelled a strong odor of an alcoholic beverage coming from Danford. The officer described Danford's speech as slurred, mumbled and difficult to understand. Danford was also wobbling unsteady on his feet. Officers had to help him walk to keep him from falling over. And as the officer reached for Danford's wallet to check his ID, Danford grabbed the officer's wrist and wouldn't let go. And despite several officers commanding him to let go several times, Danford refused. Two officers and Danford fell to the ground during a struggle. A baton had to be used on him on his back before he eventually let go. These alleged actions led to Danford being fired. You just said you have so little information. Why fire the deputy so quickly? Is it because his actions were so egregious? Well, when you talk about certain offenses, uh, it almost the, the rest of the story doesn't have to be there. In other words, when you talk about the, uh, the charges that we're talking about here, resisting arrest and public intoxication, uh, those are serious, serious uh, accusations. And from the story I was able to confirm uh, that I won't share at this point, uh, that demonstrates to me that we have enough to, to make the indefinite suspension. Now, as you just heard, Williamson County Sheriff Robert Chody allude to another incident. Now, APD would only say they are working an open investigation into Danford at this time, but we do know he is out on bail. Mike. All right, Jenny, thanks.